Take our lead, let's help you make your mark. Our goal is your satisfaction, let us show you the way. What's the point of drinking decaf? People drink decaf for varied reasons including avoiding caffeine for health reasons, avoiding jitters, to not disturb sleep, or fear of complications with medications. Decaf offers a great alternative to those who enjoy the robust and unique taste of coffee without wanting caffeine. Take our lead. Contractions in the colon push contents towards the rectum, which is the final section of your digestive tract. Research has shown that caffeine makes the colon 60% more active than water and 23% more active than decaf coffee, 6. However, studies have shown that decaf coffee can also stimulate the urge to poop. 22 March 2018. Take our lead. Decaffeinated and caffeine coffee leads to increased activity of ecto-5. Nucleotidase in kidney cortex that translates to increase in concentration of adenosine. Surprisingly, this caused improved kidney excretion function. Point 2 August 2017. Make your mark take our lead. Increased acidity in the body science tells us that coffee is highly acidic, and it stimulates excessive secretion of gastric acids. Decaf coffee is especially guilty of this, and overconsumption can quickly lead to ulcers, acid reflux, inflammatory bowel conditions, heartburn and urinary tract infections. Point 13 February 2018. Take our lead. The decaffeinated espresso proved the point. It did not raise blood caffeine levels, but it boosted the average systolic blood pressure of the non-drinkers by 12 mm Hg, virtually as much as the high test brew. 3 April 2019. Take our lead. The simple answer is no, decaf coffee will not keep you awake. The more complex answer is as follows. Caffeine levels in decaffeinated coffee are incredibly low, but it does depend on the process the 15th of October 2020. Make your mark, take our lead. If you're making the change, or at least considering it, but don't want to totally deprive yourself of coffee, decaf coffee can be a good compromise. Despite its name, decaf coffee isn't 100% caffeine-free, sorry. One study showed that most decaffeinated coffees have between 8 and 14 mg of caffeine. 28 July 2019. Let's help you make your mark. For these individuals, decaf is an excellent way to enjoy coffee without the side effects of too much caffeine. Decaf has most of the same health benefits as regular coffee, but none of the side effects. Make your mark, take our lead. The cardiovascular health study found no link between decaf and heart failure risk, while the Framingham Heart Study found that decaf was associated with a significantly higher risk of heart failure. 9 February 2021. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe and hit the bell notification.